What's up guys, Crispy Collectibles here coming at you with another deck profile. I went undefeated again. Uh, this is a different deck profile though. Uh, I wanted to shout out my friend Hayden. Uh, he recently died uh, due to COVID. And uh, this was his favorite deck. He played this deck all the time, every locals, every Wednesday and Saturday, if he showed up. This was the deck that he played. So he just died on Wednesday. Uh, I wanted to put this deck together and play it in his, in his honor tonight or today and uh, I went undefeated with it so I wanted to do a deck profile with that and shout out Hayden uh we'll miss you bro and hope all goes well with your family and everything uh yeah so let's just get into the deck profile um sorry we'll st uh start out with D shifter play uh <coughs> excuse me three D shifter Play two Silent Wabi, if you guys can guess what the deck is from this. And then, that's it for monsters. <laughs> and then the spells, we'll do three Pot of Duality, three Pot of Prosperity, uh, three Left Arm Offering, three Prohibition, three Dark Ruler No More. Uh, three Demise of the Land, two Goddess Oracles, two Field Barrier, two Cauldron of the Old Man, three Mystic Mine. That's right, guys. This is Mystic Mine Burn. One Upstart and one Terraforming. Then to the Traps, three Dark Bribe, three Solemn Judgment, and a Metaverse. So that totals 41 cards. Uh, totals 41 cards in the main deck. Uh, this isn't exactly the build that he played. I, do, I don't have his list for what he played. But uh, my friend Junior, uh, he gave me his list. And I did a little of my own stuff to it. And yeah, you know, I, I feel like the deck did really good tonight. Um, last round I played for Laundries. And I'm stupid. And I forgot they don't uh, special summon. So I left this in going game two and I opened two of them, but I felt like I would have won game two if uh, I actually read cards, but I don't. So yeah, that's 41 cards in the main deck. Then for the side and the extra deck, we'll go extra first. Got three Shizuku, three Kigari, three Link Karibo. Two Link Spider, two Proxy, and a Verde. This is supposed to be a third Proxy, but I only have two, so just until I get a third one, I'm just playing 14, because the extra deck size of this deck does not matter at all. Um, the only cards that actually matter are like these, and then like the reason you play these is uh, you play Ghost Reaper in your side deck, and Sky Striker is like heavily represented right now, so if you play this. Uh, if Sword Soul becomes more representative or represented or like PK or whatever, this is just built for like locals. This isn't built for, uh, this isn't built for like YCSs or anything, but yeah, like this is a really good card to have in here. These are needed for like tokens to like get rid of tokens. Um, uh, and then you could swap any of these out for like anything that you feel like you're gonna go up against. So like Sword Soul, you could you could put like Baron and whatever you need to put in here. And then <clears throat> you could probably swap out like a Proxy, a Link Rebo, or maybe like two of these, two of these, whatever. Maybe a Link Spider. And then like put in more like extra deck stuff that you think you're gonna face. So yeah, that's that for the extra deck. Side deck. Got two Ghost Reaper, two Lava Golem, three Cyclone, three Cursed Seals, three Evenlies, and two Unendings. I mean, obviously, your main goal is to stop anything that gets rid of any of your back row. So, this is really good to get rid of, like, Imperial Order and stuff. Same thing with, like, Cyclones and Cursed Seals. A lot of people don't main deck hate for this deck, so... There's inherent outs in the main deck, but they don't like main deck like twisters and stuff. So having these in the side deck, I feel is like a good call until people start meaning uh, 
more heavy back row like destruction. So that's it for the deck profile. Uh, something I also wanted to do was open my packs uh, as well. I got first place, so I got four packs. So we'll open Genesis Impact first, and then we'll go to the OTS. Hopefully we pull something good. Got a Bottomless Trap Hole, Book of Law, Majestus, excuse me, Born from Dragons, Nightmare Griffin, Dragon Delta, and Life Twin Home. Invoke, Herald of Ultimatus, Drytron Beta, Book of Law, Evil Twin GG, number 96, and Shiz Megasus. And then for the final pack of Ancient Guardian, or Gem Genesis Impact, I'm sorry. Nightmare Griffin, Delta, Drytron Eclipse, Invoke Cockatus, Magistus Invocation, and a Magistus Spell Spirit. Now for the OTS pack, let's see what we get. It's not an ulti, unfortunately. Floodgate Trap Hole, Lady in White, and a Scrap Golem. So that is it for the pulls, guys, and that's it for the deck profile. As always, keep it crispy. Again, shout outs to Hayden. Uh, we're gonna miss you, dude. And uh, yeah, keep it crispy. Have a good day, guys.